eight electrodes drive four circuits, two on the top side embedded into the part, two on the bottom part side embedded, and they built a circuit that's called a Wheatstone bridge that reacts to load. So when the part is loaded, it bends. So the two circuits on the bottom, they act under extension. The two circuits on the top, they act under compression. And this gives you a very good signal to noise ratio. Let us see the experiment. We have this little part clamped into the system. From the eight electrodes, we have wired them to a PCB board. This PCB board is only in the amplifier and the Bluetooth antenna. So that the Bluetooth antenna is transmitting the signal to this tablet. We have an application there where you can see live how the wave is loaded onto the part. Can I take it and control? So as Sterling is loading the part, he's putting waves. You can see how the wave and the app reacts to that wave. <laughs> so it's still green. We can, if, if we add more, we go into the yellow region. And believe me, that you get up to the red region if the part is overloaded. So we normally don't go to the red region because we still want to make more demos with the part. And so let it be there. Thank you, Sterling. Thank you, everybody. <laughs>